Okay, so before this video starts, this video isn't going to be a full-on guide on how to play Aggressive Sonic, but more of a rundown on how it works. If you want to learn how to play Sonic, I recommend the, um, the You're Too Slow Smash Ultimate Sonic Guide. I'll be putting more resources in the description, so if you already know how to play Sonic, go ahead and keep watching. And if you don't know how to play Sonic, watch anyways, I don't mind. Alright, so let's talk about aggressive slash rush down Sonic. I like to call him Rush Down Sonic, cause like Rush, Sonic Rush. <coughs> so I know what you're thinking, what is aggressive Sonic? So aggressive Sonic is basically a playstyle where Sonic plays more aggressively. It's uh, kind of self-explanatory. Now the reason why the term aggressive Sonic exists is because if you look at most Sonics in tournament play, they um, seem to go for a more playstyle that's not entertaining to watch. It's more of a campy playstyle. But basically, Sonic has the tools to be campy due to being not only the fastest character in the game, but also carrying one of the safest moves in the game, which is Spin Dash. Spin Dash is really good. It can go into other moves, it racks up damage, and it's really hard to challenge for most characters. So basically the playstyle is that you want your opponent to try to make a mistake while trying to approach you with spin dash and then punishing them with some of its other moves. Basically it's just a game of cat and mouse and if you make a mistake during that game of cat and mouse, Sonic catches you, he racks up damage and he's probably going to take your stock. But let's be honest guys, that playstyle is not fun to watch and people are going to hate you if you play that way. But um, basically you can go for the much more better and much more appreciated and respected playstyle which is aggressive and rush down sonic basically aggressive and rush down sonic is the exact opposite of what a campy sonic is so basically instead of sonic waiting for his opponent to mess up sonic has no time to wait for um, his opponent to mess up and just gets in on the fly Alright, so you've seen the difference between the two different playstyles, so basically I'll just go do more of like the science of it. So basically one of the first things that you see a lot more spin charge than spin dash. Basically spin dash is a defensive move while spin charge is just an aggressive version of spin dash. Firstly, the move on multi hits and you can combo into it so you can do stuff like this. Instant 50% in one combo starting with Spin Charge. Sonic racks up damage really quickly and is really dangerous in this playstyle. But he can also be a danger to himself because one of the other moves that you see a lot is Homing Attack. Homing Attack is really good, but the one huge con is that if it misses, it gets really bad. You can get punished really hard because of Homing Attack's end lag. And even off stage, if the Homing Attack misses, you just go flying off stage. And you have to be in a situation where you have to try to recover. And if you know how to recover, it's pretty easy. But if you, you, you get like edge guarded really hard if you miss with homing attack off stage or on stage, it doesn't matter. You can just get punished like really hard for just throwing out this move. But you definitely see it a lot more. Yeah. And plus, aggressive stomach is just fun. Like, that's that, like, where's the fun in doing campy stuff? Aggressive Sonic is just really fun. Aggressive Sonic just kind of shows, like, the real potential of the character and, like, how cool, like, his combo. Like, his Sonic's combo game is nuts, and you don't really get to see it that often because of the um, play style. Now, this doesn't mean that all aggressive tournament player Sonics are, like, campy. If you want to watch, like, aggressive playstyle Sonics in tournament, I recommend that you watch Kraftis and Sonido, and I guess a bit of Sonics as well. They're both, like, really, really, like, aggressive Sonic players. Especially Kraftis. Kraftis is crazy with, um, aggressive Sonic. And on top of that, there's going to be guides in the description, like, combo guides by Lego. There's the full Year 2 Slow Smash Ultimate guide that I mentioned before. And alongside videos by Clockwork Videos, I'll also include that as well. But yeah, basically that's all I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, I wanted to like make a little like, little tiny little guide, but not really a guide. Since a lot of people were like, some people kind of asked me for like, to make a guide for my Sonic. And uh, I've never really made a full on just guide. So, and there's already like multiple Sonic guys out there, so I thought I would just give you guys a little like rundown on how I play this character. 
So yeah, that's about it. Just basically um, take this character into your hands and play in this playstyle however you want to. And yeah, that's about it. I'll see you guys in another video.